Hello everyone and welcome back to Fear and Hunger Termina. So, well, Termina, actually. Forgot that it's actually pronounced that way. Anywho, in the last episode, uh, yeah, lots of stuff happened. <laughs> of course, lots of stuff happened. Uh, we managed to turn around and get the keys to actually get into the city. Uh, we actually managed to save Tanaka, and I can't remember the boxer's name, but we managed to save him also. But we had to kill Pav in the process. But we also noticed that the ex-soldier, I can't remember his name, um, he's also perished in the process. So we have two people that have now fallen in the Festival of Termina. So one thing I wanted to do, though, is if you notice this where I'm at right now, this is actually not the current save that I'm on. This is actually the previous save where I was in the room with Marina. So one of the comments did let me know uh, that, of course, there are different situations that happens at different times of day. And of course, throughout the Festival of Tamina, characters will go missing, characters have their own agendas, etc., etc. And I was thinking about it and I wondered if maybe perhaps the reason why Marina had the little exclamation point by her character or whatever was because maybe she didn't like being out at night. Maybe she had a phobia about it, even though I think the actual phobia that it said that Marina had in the game was er er erotophobia, which is, a, I think, a fear of porn or sexual things and stuff like that. I'm not sure. Uh, I do rem remember reading something about it, but I can't remember it right now, right off the top of my head. But I wanted to see if perhaps maybe the reason why is because it was at nighttime or something like that. So I'm going to go ahead and go back to this save and I'm going to see if I save again and then proceed to the next day. Will that change things? Now, the other aspect of that, though, is that if I turn around and go to the next day, I may lose some characters in the process. I really hope I don't, but we'll see. But, and I'm gonna also have to go back and do everything and kill everybody and stuff like that again. But it would make things a lot easier if I did have another person with me. So I'm going to see if that works. So let's hop into it. Even though first, let me talk to him because I noticed, I don't know if it's a bug, but it seems like whenever I try to just load up a save and then I go straight to leave. If it's one of the saves where it's going to the next day, it seems like it bugs out and it freezes up. So I just want to make sure that I didn't encounter that again. Okay. Now let's go ahead and go through all this again. I don't think I really have to pay attention much to it because it's everything that's at the top. So I don't actually have to hit up or down or anything. Okay. And, 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 and even still, I think the only thing that we actually did at night was, uh, what was it? I think the only thing we did was, uh, we killed the pig guy. That, that was the only thing. So yeah, nothing too crazy happened, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this head pause and um <laughs> and if that doesn't work i might just go ahead in the other save and get the uh goat man i can't remember what i actually need to do i do have the key i believe to go ahead and go to the basement so that shouldn't be an issue but yeah we'll see yeah i'll rest for a bit and that'll take me back to the save now again i hope she doesn't disappear Okay, nobody's dead yet. And I will save this right here. Do I want to do that? I'll save it on the first save. Yep, didn't mean to hit that. And let's go to leave. Now we're on to day two. Under the sulfur sun. Is she still in the party? Yeah, she's still in the party and she still has that thing by her. 
So yeah, I don't know what phobia she has. And I don't know what's making her just randomly disappear, but uh, maybe if I try talking to her. Mm, maybe if I try heading towards the train, I, I honestly don't know. Let's see if she disappears after some time. Uh, my master's waiting for you in the dining room. Sit upstairs, turn left. Please do mind your manners. Now, usually she would disappear by the time I got to one of the other screens over here, but Let's see, maybe if I go through the slums, maybe. Like I just don't know how to keep her in the party. But I would really appreciate it if she stayed because my God, I need help. It is funny because I have been on um, Discord a couple times and on the uh, Fear and Hunger Discord. And I hear, or I've seen certain people talk about how they have all these people in their party. And I'm like, I have nobody. Like, this is some straight BS. I have had absolutely nobody in my party this entire time. Maybe if I fight somebody. Let's see if I fight somebody with that help. Uh, yeah, you get a leg and I'll get the other leg. Oh God. Okay, and we're both gonna attack the head. Oh, okay, so now it's gone. So I wonder if maybe she just had like a fear of fighting in combat or something and now it's gone. Um, hmm. I'm still gonna go ahead and just kind of walk around for a bit to see if she stays, but. Nope. Yeah, like, where does she fuck off to? Huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to do about that. I really don't know what to do about that. And I can't remember again, I can't remember if she did that during the demo. I feel like she did. But I can't be sure. Maybe she's in the city somewhere. But, all right, there's that. So I'll go ahead and load up the other save and get back to it and head to the city. All right, so just one quick thing here. I wanted to go ahead and give these heads to this guy. So I do have the woodsman's head and I do have the priest's head. So let's go ahead and give him these. The woodsman. Okay. And here's the priest, the priest, even in death, his face disgusts me. The wall is complete. Have at you. You got the shield of the four. Oh, okay. What does that do for me? Um, I already have the Bremen chest plate on. And I have a gas mask on. Shield of the four. An enchanted shield with severed heads placed to ward off otherworldly powers. Hmm. Interesting. Um, this gives me M defense. What is M defense? Is this like main defense? 
So that would be plus six, but I would lose the current plus three that I have. Um, what does optimize say? So it says shield of the forward arm guards. Interesting. Um, so let's change this. And yeah, I think that'll be it. Uh, gas mask of the Roman flame troopers. Flame troopers were often used in city warfare where they would scorch everything in sight. Slash 91%. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. All right. I guess I'll stay with that then. Uh, maybe that will help me out quite a bit. Don't know. All right. That's done. Okay. Another thing I decided to go ahead and do is to go ahead and go into the basement to see about the goat man or the goat out there. Maybe I can recruit, or I mean recruit them. I don't know what's in this basement though. Lavender, lavender. Cause some things have changed. So hopefully there's no enemies down here. And I don't remember what exactly I needed to paint. In order to uh, in order to travel around or travel to the area to recruit the goat man or black I think it was called black Caleb it's been a while that's nothing There is a seemingly dead old lady here. She seems to be holding tight onto a piece of torn paper. Investigate. She's been dead for a while now, judging from the looks of her. Her head has been bashed with something and her wrists are cut open. You cannot tell which one led to her demise. She doesn't seem to have anything valuable. The note has been written with blood. I'll reunite with my lover on the other side. Okay. You check the bookshelves for anything interesting. Anathemia. And I can't check that. I'm going to assume that the outline of whatever is there is what I need to actually write down. But which symbol is that? Is that Almer? I think that's Almer. Uh, cause for her is, I'm guessing it's like the double moon one or a double round circle one, similar to what's in the left hand corner right there. And then what's our myrrh? Or do I not have a book of Almer this time? I don't. Yeah, I just have fear and hunger, Grogorth and Rehur. Fear and hunger, hunger is the M. It's similar to the Termina logo. And. Gorath. That's the moon one. Okay. So which one is her? Hmm. This makes me kind of nervous because I don't want to end up using the wrong symbol. There's something written here, but it's all nonsensical sensical ramblings of a crazy person. Literally everybody in this game at this point. There's something written here with blood. He was more of a man than you could have ever been. Twice the size, in fact. Okay. There's something written here with blood. Oh, I'm starting to feel hungry. I let his cold member inside me. Even my loins couldn't warm it up. Yes, I did it. I laid with Black Caliph. 
I tasted his seed. Oh, God. All right. There's something written here with blood. Best fuck of my life. Good for you, you know. Good for you. I mean, what else could possibly go wrong in this game? Okay. Um, goat screwing aside. What can I use here? A ritual circle carved here. You could actually use it if you had something to drop. Oh shit. Uh, I needed some. I need some chalk. I thought I bought some, but that could have also been one of the other saves I had. I do remember a couple times I did buy some along the way, but I'm pretty sure I also died in those saves. So I guess we'll go ahead and leave this for now. And again, I don't think I actually have the right symbol anyway. I think I need the symbol of Almer. And I don't have that. All right, we're back in the city now. Good Lord. I had to abandon the whole plan in order to get to uh, get some chalk. I don't have any shillings, so. So now I'm gonna have to just try and make it on my own. Good God. <laughs> Dirty toilet paper, really. Purifying talisman. Light blue vial. Okay. All right. Also, I another thing I saw on Discord too is that apparently the dialogue has either changed with the uh, Bobby or you have to have the persuasion skill. And I think Karen is the only one with the persuasion skill. So kind of boned in that sense. So I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna straight up attack the guy, and hopefully at some point I can uh, stagger him, and then we can drop this motherfucker. Stop hitting me. Okay. Also, does he actually fall? Oh shit, he doesn't. Well, that's not good. Jesus, man, is your head never gonna stop moving? Great. Oh, okay, there we go. Um, rev up. So at the very least, I'll get two strikes. Hopefully one of them will hit. Yes. Now I gotta make sure stomp on him. Okay, the body of the Bobby was still pulsating steadily, but now it stopped. Yeah, otherwise he's just gonna get right back up, and I don't wanna deal with that. Okay, I got a small key. So oh, fuck. Let me go. I don't wanna deal with this right now. Come on, move it. And then I can use that small key over here. Oh God. Ah. Yes, use the small key, thank you. Okay, old old tale, the stench of mold hits you the moment you step inside. Okay, good. Like water damage is here. I got a light blue vial. I'm actually okay with health. We'll go ahead and eat though. Also, I did get another skill. I forgot that I had killed path, so I had a soul. And the skill that I got, one second while I eat. Uh, oh, well, let's go into the actual eating part. 
Uh, what should I eat? Some dried meat. Okay. Um, the skill that I got was bury the trauma. So bury the trauma and fears. This reduces your sanity decline. The uh, the your descent. Oh my god! This reduces your sanity decline while exploring. You can deal with the psychiatric collapse and the combat fatigue once you're in a safer place after all this. So yeah, that's what I pretty much got. Um, and there's another small little tree that I can go through some things with. I think one of the other skills is unguard, but uh, yeah. So I got that. Okay. What's in here? I hope somebody is actually in here that can help me. White vow. Don't want to eat that. Sure, I guess. Tell mushroom stew. Why is that inside of some luggage? Can I not open this? Is that not a thing to be open? Okay. Turning it to mush. The thing looks like it's been exposed to water damage in here. Okay, nothing back here. That stairs right there. Oh, wait. The staircase has collapsed. You mean to tell me I came in here for absolutely no reason? Great. Wonderful. This is literally just a place that I can stop for a second. Great. Wonderful. So that was a waste of a key. Huh. Can I rest in this chair? Dirty ashtray. Nope. Yeah, this was just a gigantic waste of time. That's all this was. Huh. Well, back out here. Shit. Ow. Shit. Okay, come on, keep going. Oh boy. Oh, am I bleeding or anything? Nope, I'm not bleeding. Oh, I got some heroin. Great. Now, if I could find the soldier guy, be even better. Oh. I strongly advise keeping your distance. You notice the yellow mage ahead. What do you mean? People approach the festival different ways. I don't know you well enough to tell what your true intentions are. Hey man, we ain't got time for this. So as a precaution, just keep your distance and perhaps you will see tomorrow. I don't intend to take unnecessary risks. It's nothing personal. Uh, you don't need to fear me. I do not fear you. I gave you a warning. If you come closer, I consider that hostile behavior. Act accordingly. Actually, motherfucker, I need to get through there. Jesus. Great. This is all working out wonderfully. Um. I'm sorry. I'm just going to have to attack you. No, 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 no. Fucking hell. I think it's I'm just gonna get rid of his hands oh fuck ow and I just lost my left fucking leg great uh damn oh this is turning out wonderfully so far damn it I'm gonna kill me. Jesus. Uh, item. Got a light blue bow. 
I mean, it doesn't really matter how I lost my legs. Say, please don't have any more. Okay, thank you. We're missing now. Just miss one more time. All right, good. I'm sorry, buddy. Didn't have to end this way. God, you absorb the enlightened soul. I did not mean to turn into this guy, but I have turned into that guy who's just murdering people left and right. That was supposed to be a different safe. Okay, I quickly gotta heal myself. Cloth fragment. And I do have a blue vibe, but I really don't want to use it. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, I think I'm not going to use that blue vial right now. What I'm going to do instead is I'm going to mix and I'm gonna craft the mixed herbs because I do have that. Yeah, and I'll wait. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait for right now. Wait. Turtleneck shirt. Oh, because I have cloth. Okay. Um. Oh, I can tear it up and use it to make uh cloth fragments. Okay. I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, I'm not gonna use that blue vial just yet. I think I'll live. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. I am in danger. I am in serious danger. Everywhere. Okay, your footsteps echo in the presence of the older gods. You mother. Oh, I thought that was Marina. That's not Marina. That's somebody else. The teachings of Almer are written on the Bible. Eye for an eyes leads to everyone being blind, but when everyone involved is blind already, there is very little to lose. Blind in your quest for power, I am blind in my quest for vengeance. Okay. There seems to be a place for something here. There are carvings of an old time, old time, of an old time language. The martyr that tries to overcome its idols. Okay. Right. Great, got a light blue vowel. Some beer. Two shillings. Okay. Lucky coin. Four shillings. Now I do remember there being people in here that I need to fight, but I don't really remember how I actually got around in this place. I do remember there being some climbing I had to do. That's foul. Can I? It's a confessional. Cleanse yourself of sins. Oh no. Am I gonna end up getting hurt? An overwhelming aura fills the air as you sit down to the confessional. The claustrophobic little box creates an atmosphere of condemnation and spite. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. No answer. Is there someone there? You do not see anyone on the other side.
Hmm. You feel no change for spending time in the confessional. Was it all just a waste of time? I'm guessing later on somebody's going to be in there. No, I don't need to use a match right now. Okay. Don't really see anything around here so far. The air is filled with the absolutely disgusting scent of gore. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. We had to go through the church in order to go through the sewers in order to go through. I think we end up getting a key or something like that. And then we could use that in order to get into the city or something to that effect. Okay. This is all great so far. Someone left their toolbox here. You find craftsman's note. You don't quite know what you're looking at. There's gore and all things disgusting in bits and pieces. Okay, Craftsman's Notes. James, it happened again. Those kids stole the tools for the umpteenth time. If I ever catch them in the act, there's going to be hell to pay. The priest told me that everyone under the Ascended One share all possession. Nothing is mine and nothing is yours. All is that of Almer. What mumbo jumbo? That might work for the priest and all, but he's not the one doing these renovations under a strict schedule. In the future, I'll hide the toolbox. I got the perfect spot in the mind in mind already. When you enter the second hall, you know those statues? They are pointing they are pointing one to another. Just follow their lead. The last one points at the spot near the wall. I'll leave the box under the floor tiling there. Also, just to make it more difficult for those thieving little rats, I decided it's best to close the underground passage to the renovation site. Father Domic took one of the key effigies to his orphanage. One was left for the priests here, and I'll take the last one to my own apartment. So if you need to use the passage, let me know. You copy the locations mentioned on the note to your map. Okay. So let me see if I can follow that. So that way, that way, that way. The floor tile feels loose here. Investigate. There's a toolbox buried here. Inside you find the bolt cutters. Also, there's two bolts, duct tape, and a bottle of vodka. Okay. Now, what do I need the bolt cutters for? What does it say exactly? Mm, bolt cutters. A tool used for cutting chains, padlocks, bolts, and wires. The handles are positioned with the best leverage in mind. Hmm. I wonder if the sewer entrance over on the other side of the train, I wonder if they need bolt cutters. I'm not sure. I kind of want to go back and see. But I also really don't want to go back out there. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Uh, okay. Let me try to go up these. Nothing crazy so far. Green herb. Six shillings. Okay, I'm up here. Wait, isn't this where I'm going to be in danger? Open it. I think I had heads before, so tails. Yep, got it. 
Salmon snake room. Interesting. Oh, fuck. Yeah, let's not do that. Uh, not just yet. <laughs> Let me check out the other side first. Okay, let's go over here. I'm guessing it's going to be pretty much the same thing. Oh, great. Except there's actually a way for them to get to me. Oh, a sword. Ah, fuck. Nope. 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 Oh! Ow. You hurt your ankle pretty badly. You mean my ankles that I don't use? Because I don't use those. Uh... I guess I could go ahead and use that blue vial now too. Just in case I end up in a fight. I don't wanna start off at a disadvantage. Okay, so I do need to be careful of that. I don't know how much damage that actually does to me, but I'm pretty sure it does some damage. I don't remember that sword up there in the demo either. But I'm also not really that concerned with it. Ah, shit. Wrong way. Okay. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, damn. Um, well, it looks like I'm going to have to fight that guy. Or I can go around and see if I can find another way. Oh, what the hell? Oh, God. Um... Should I guard? What should I do here? Um. Oh, damn. This dude is really sturdy. Yeah, it's either. No, no, no I did not mean to hit that. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Yeah, this does not seem like that guy. And I can't escape. Great. Oh, fuck. Ow. Well, I dodged that, but I'm still in a bit of a pickle here. This is going to be how I die. I do have ammo, but I'm... Oh, fuck. Or whatever. Can I please leave now? Thank you. Okay. Um, this is not the place to be. Uh, there's a rope tied on the beam. Untie the rope. I don't know what that does for me. If it does anything at all.
But I do feel like where I need to go is on the other side, not the of those guys, but shit. I'm gonna, at the very least, it looks like I'm gonna have to beat one of them. Oh, wait. It's down there. There's a body of a naked man here, investigate. Uh, judging from the smell, he seems to have died long ago. Okay, so that did not help me at all. Great, wonderful. This is all great things so far. Um, what happens if I go up this way? I'm gone, buddy. I am gone. So maybe that was what I needed to do, hopefully. Now, where's the body? I feel like it should be around here. There's a body of a woman in a wedding dress here. The woman seems to still have her wedding ring on. Take it? You take the Bettles stone. What is that? Sure is an accessory. Bettles stone, the ring of a long gone new god, Bettle. The ring has magic imbued in it that is constantly leaking from the crystal. Okay. That doesn't really help me, but all right. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really feel like I've really accomplished anything here. Um. And I mean, I do kind of want to explore up top, but I don't think there's anything for me to really do up there. And I don't want to waste any of my time up there. It's not fruitful. Uh, hmm. How much ammo do I have? I got two shots. And I'm pretty sure those things are going to take way more than two shots. Do I still have the other ammo? Yeah, I've got two of those and five of the nine millimeter bullets. Um, I guess I could go ahead and use the pistol. And if old buddy is still standing there looking stupid, I can shoot him. So let's see how that works. Chain seems to. Oh. Okay. So that's what I needed to do, I guess. Nope, 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 nope. I'm gone, buddy. You had your chance. You missed it. Leave me alone. So does that do anything for me? 
Oh, right, because that opens up a hole, and then I can go through that hole in order to get into the basement. Oh, I mean, do I really want to go down there? Oh, God. Okay. Um. Well, then. Shit. I don't really want to go down there. Oh, fuck me. I mean, I'm just... Oh, God, I have to do everything on my own. Like, come on. Also, what the hell is check check? Yeah, it's an accessory. Uh, whip. A seemingly simple shaker instrument. The combination of the pebbles inside and the various pearls tied onto it create a hypnotic rhythm that helps one to focus on the otherworldly. Okay. Sure. Whatever you say. Mm. And I'm guessing that I have to jump down there. The chandelier has crashed through the floor. You could jump down if you wanted to. Great. And I'm guessing I can't get back up. Booby trap. Iron spear. Gotta be honest, I'm pretty sure it's stronger, but... Wait, it's not a weapon? No? Okay, it's not that. It's not that. Huh. So, what the hell is the iron spear? It's just a regular item? Bolt cutters. Hmm. Oh, yeah, it is a weapon. I guess I just can't use it. An old iron spear that was still used by the cavalry of Bohemia a few decades ago, up until firearms became more prevalent in this region. So, yeah, I guess because I'm in a wheelchair, I guess I can't use it. Also, the map was updated, correct? Okay, that's the church. Uh, the orphanage is up there. I don't know how the hell I would get up there. It looks like I need to go behind the church, apparently. Hmm. Maybe I should have tried going there instead of coming in here. Okay, a lot of blood and gore. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, great. Another one of these guys. But he's locked up for right now, so shouldn't have to worry about him just yet. Nope. Is there anybody in there? Looks like I can barely see something up there, but I don't know what. But I would prefer they stay locked up. Glass file. Blood. Big pool of blood. A pool of blood. The blood looks relatively fresh. You can see the silhouette of your reflection in the blood. It distorts beyond recognition. Okay. It's not unsettling at all. Why we just got pools of... What the hell? Why we just got pools of blood sitting around? Am I being attacked? There's writing of blood here. The bloodshed attracts them. What? This thing just flared up like I was going to be attacked. Ball of beer. Carrot. Booby trap. Blue vial. I'm going to use that right now, as a matter of fact. Healing, blue vial. Okay, can I get this? Whatever this is. Great, another blue vial. 
not gonna use it now, but still, I'm glad I got it. But yeah, what was? Why did this thing flare up? Maybe it was somebody down the hallway. Okay, nothing in here. I think something is behind me. There's writing of blood here. They came from the pools of blood. Oh, shit. Well, that's disconcerting. What the fuck is that? Three matches. The statue of a winged being seemed to be holding something. Um, sure, reach out and grab it. You take the martyr effigy. You cannot quite explain why, but the small statuette feels to hold great importance. I'm guessing I need to put that upstairs in that area. Um, how the fuck do I get out of here? Oh, okay, cool. All right. Jesus, because I was like, this is that would be really dumb if there was nobody that had keys or anything like that. So, okay, now I can get around. Um, yeah, I need to eat. So, food, some dried meat. My mind is not in the best state. So let's drink some beer. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> it's healing. Of course it's healing. Okay. Now with that, I uh, don't need to go that way. I do need to be careful because I think there's at least two enemies in here. Yeah, there's somebody in there. Now let's check this one. Who are you? Looks like he has taken over the bed. There's some writing on the papers. Who's laughing now? Who's laughing now, I ask. I found the safest place in this rotten town. Who's the stupid one now? Okay. Uh, sure. Uh, I think the last one was tails, so heads? Shit. Okay. There's nothing in that one. Yeah, and this one doesn't actually do anything for me. Hmm. And I feel like letting that thing out would just be really bad. That's an enemy. Ah, oh, great. One of these guys. Uh, fuck. Thank you. Ow. Jesus. Uh, I guess I. No, the head is usually the weakest, so it'll be fine. Okay. Search him two shillings. That's all he had. Okay. And I have a host of issues right here. Again, I can use some uh, dirty toilet paper for this. And 
I have two areas of infection. Mm, mixed herbs. I guess I could go ahead and use this now. Takes out both of those. And it, yeah, I mean, I don't really need to do anything else. What is this area of the wall? Why does it look like that? Guess it's nothing. There's some writings on the papers. I hear them at night. They slither the dark corridors. We are just sacrificial lambs to them, waiting for slaughter. Do I need to go in there? Like, do I need to let him go or something like that? Because I really feel like I don't need to let him go. Uh, open it. Oh, that doesn't work. Surely I can use this key somewhere else. But it's not looking like it right now. Jesus. Yeah, because I mean, there's nothing I can do right there. Maybe I do have to let that guy out. Maybe he'll barrel through one of the things or something. Oh, okay. He doesn't do anything. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I think that takes me to that boss. Um, the, the guy that was in the original Fear and Hunger. I am not going to do that. It's a big fuck no. The altar of the new gods. To appease the one sitting at the grand hall, you must put forth a worthy offering. You have an offering. You have three severed heads in your possession, one of which are non contestant heads. Do you want to sacrifice them all? Sure. The tainted one rises slowly from the pool of blood. Oh, fuck. Unbearable existence, the suffering, the agony. We play the secret song that echoes from within, the sound that is like razors through flesh. Can you hear it? Yes, you can hear my voice after all. You who came with the offering, ask and thou shall receive. You receive three soul stone shards. O oh, explorer of the further regions, farewell. That's not what I asked. The air got lighter again. Feels like a burden is off your shoulders. Hell, I would have preferred to have a teammate. The hell am I gonna do with three shards? Where am I? This is going further down. I don't want to go further down. Oh, fuck. Oh, it was a trap. God oh, damn it. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Shit. Please miss. Ow. Oh, it only lasted one turn. Cool. I feel like I need to block for some reason. Uh, oh, right. I don't need to even worry about that because, yeah, things. Ow. Great. Right. 
fantastic so far. Ow. Okay, one more time. No. At least it knocked me out of it. Damn. 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 Oh, come on. Oh, my God. So I was a little angry and I decided to kill both of them. Sorry about that. I'm just going to take your heads. Take yours. All right. Oh, so it was a symbol of her. Okay. What do I do about that now? Where the hell am I? Okay, let's go through here. Oh, can I get Black Caleb now? Because I need help. Like, I, I really need a partner. Or, hey, Jesus. Another one heeds my call. Just remember that you came to me, not the vice versa. Tell me, oh naive one, do you believe in the pitch black darkness? Um, uh, considering how many people I've killed so far, I live in and for the darkness. Truly? The true darkness is a rare gift. The saying goes, there's no light without it casting a shadow. Good on one hand, and the evil on the other. Good can come from bad places, just as bad can come from the good. Constant struggle, game even. That is how it is meant to be, that is how it was. A man listened to his spirit, and you could tarnish that spirit so easily. But it wasn't to last. Then people started to worship a new god, the god called the science. Suddenly everything needed to be calculated before putting into consideration. There is no good or evil behind the scope. Maybe my time has come to lend a sword once again. I will aid you in your quest. See you soon. Okay. So I have a party member now. Hopefully they'll be around longer than a couple panels. What happens if I go up here? Oh. So, I guess I'll eat real quick. Dried meat, as usual. And that should mean Black Caleb should be mine. What's up, buddy? The lone goat came to greet you. The goat seems to be following your every move intensively. Want to join my party? The goat is shaking its horn in agreement. The goat joins your party. Thank fuck. Because God, I need help. All right, buddy. Um, let me give you a carrot. Uh, now, do I just feed him carrots? Or is there like a dialogue option there? Black Caleb has got a blank expression on his face. He's slowly chewing a brown tuft of weed in his mouth. The more you look at Caleb, the more annoyed he starts to look. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'll just feed him a carrot. Wait, I only have two? Oh, fuck. I thought I had way more carrots than that. 
Because to my understanding, he only stays around if you have carrots to feed him. Shit. Well, let me hurry up and get to the city and see if I can at least let him soak up some of the damn damage. That's the main thing here. I'm not really concerned about him staying permanently. I just need him to be a distraction, really. Also, I need your head. Uh, nope. Saw it off. Okay, okay, okay. I'm leaving shit. Oh, damn it. Come on. Let's hurry up through this. Purifying talisman, ornament, lantern, and I saw a buddy coming behind me, so. Sure. All right. For justice and order. Okay. Uh, let me. Because I don't think he might stagger, but I'm not terribly certain about it. Okay. Jesus. I didn't want him to immediately start taking damage, but all right. Jesus. He is beating his ass, but all right. Uh... Could you stop hitting the goat, please? I'll let him do it one more time, but I didn't want the I didn't want Blackhead to die against him. Oh fuck. Oh damn. Black Caleb, it would have been real nice if you used that on his arm, I mean on his chest or something. Stop attacking his arms. I mean, I appreciate you missing. Uh, give up. Attack that chest. There we go. Okay, and then let's beat him. Search three shillings. Okay. Go up ahead and go up these stairs. Oh, this guy, god damn it. Wonderful. Just where I wanted to be. This is what I always wanted to do. Mm, yeah, sure. Great. Great. And I still got hit with poison. Wonderful. What the fuck are you trying to hit, Caleb? Oh, God. Fails? Yes. Okay. God. Um, you know what? I'm gonna give you a pep pill. How about that? Jesus. I don't even know what he's trying to hit. Good lord. Man. 
man, what is he made of? Good lord. Uh, okay, it's gone. Jesus. <laughs> A pistol? What? <laughs> Oh, that's bullshit. That is actual bullshit. Luckily, he doesn't seem to be very good at using it. all the way around. Ow. Okay, he doesn't have arm, any arms now. That probably means he's just gonna tackle me. Uh, let me heal. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Yep, he's gonna start tackling people. Ah, shit. Fuck. Knew it. And I'm just slowly but surely dying. Wonderful. Great. This was completely not worth it. And now I'm just completely fucked. <laughs> Poison. Infection. Bleeding. <sighs> so... Um, let's just do that. Then I use a cloth fragment on myself. Got two white vials. Um, let's see, Jesus. Healing. I need. Okay, I got the green herbs, so. But, I mean, I'm still screwed with everything else because I don't have any blue herbs. Three syringes of heroin. Thanks. Saw off his head. Head of needles. Okay, that was his name. Yeah, I need, I need health. I need health, like, really bad. Oh, fuck, I didn't mean to go down that far. Jesus. Is there a cop up here? Oh, pocket cat. Hello. There's someone crouched over here. You're not gonna get any judgments from me, man. I'm not concerned right now. Oh, okay. Maybe a little judgment. There's a tall man here wearing what seems to be a rubber mask. Oh, oh. Here I am busy with my own business, completely ignoring this beautiful ship hit. All apologies. Pleased to meet you. You can call me Pocket Cat. Dots. You have one of those familiar faces. I feel like we've met somewhere before, perhaps in a past life. Um, maybe? Things sure have changed since then, haven't they? We live in peculiar times. 
The world has gone through true darkness. The world has been at a standstill, a deep rest. People stocked up on toilet paper and hid in their homes with their loved ones. They were waiting for that glimpse of light just because they knew that even the darkness has a breaking point. Say, old sport, what do you think follows such intense darkness? Um, growth into something new. Yes, change is the only thing inevitable. From personal experience, I'd say a true darkness is followed by chaos. The mind, or the common consciousness, we all share strives for something new. When one is truly done with the darkness, one strives for new with such vigor that growing pains are inevitable. But there lies the danger, you see. Chaos can ragdoll us into any one direction. The direction is not always towards the light. Sometimes one can find themselves lost in a limbo that is the chaos. When you enter the limbo from a dark place, there's a big chance that you contaminate the chaos with your darkness and just create a new pitch black place. Maybe even darker than the one before? Dots. I guess I'm just rambling here. Letting my mind wander and mouth slander, as they say. You know me, when I get excited, I can go on and on and on. I didn't mean to take your time. From what I understand, you've got your hands full with the festival already. So I'll get straight to the point. Not only a wandering gentleman, but I am also a head salesman of sorts with deep, deep pockets. <laughs> what is a head salesman, you ask? Well, it is exactly what it sounds. I'm willing to part from my valuable collection if the price is right, and the price is sever heads of those participating in the festival. I have a few of those. Macabre, I know. But you get used to it. God knows I did. This is what I have to offer. It is quite a nice collection, even if I say so myself. Three contestant heads is all you've got. What do you want to trade for? Ah, uh, Oh, a book of enlightenment. I need a book of enlightenment so bad. Um, I'm actually probably going to end up immediately using that, too. Damn, and it is three. So I don't really need these. Um, I have Alchemilia, and I'm really good at it anyway. So, yes, give me a book of enlightenment. I'm, I'm good. Thank you. I really appreciate you, Pocket Cat. Happy to do business with you. It truly was a pleasure to meet you once again, but I fear I must go for now. The tower you were heading towards, it is to the east of here, just beyond the church's hidden passage. Let us meet again there. Perhaps I'll even have a special deal for you. My pockets are very deep, you see. But until that time, old sport, take care, take care. Oh, thank fuck, because I did not, I, I am so boned. I'm actually gonna go ahead and use that right now because of how screwed I am. So let me, yeah, I'm just gonna use it right here. I'm not gonna do it over the save that I have currently. The book radiates light in every color of the spectrum. You feel like your journey has just begun as if your existence since this very moment has been like watching someone else entirely. You feel the perspective shift in your surroundings as if everything was to shrink or perhaps you were to ascend higher. You gain better understanding of yourself. The link between your mind and body has started its deterioration. Okay, I'll save it right there. You feel closer to enlightenment. As you finish reading the book, it crumbles into dust before your very eyes. Okay, and with that, I'm not gonna end it just yet. I wanna see where this goes. I'm probably gonna die here in a second anyway, so. Bone saw, piece of chalk, open heads, it's tails. Also, let me give uh, you a carrot. Appreciate that, you douche. Let's see where this goes. 
Only a lone wind how accompanies you in these empty alleyways. The gate is locked from the other side. Okay. I don't know if this was in the demo. Back into this place. Let me check these. A blue vial. Thank God. I am going to instantly use that now because I am in so much danger. On me. Sorry. Uh, that's probably not good. You can hear a sound of wasps or flies somewhere. Another one. Um, again, I'm going to use that on myself because I need all the health I can get. And if I die, it's over with. Okay, let's see what's in here. Old apartments. Cobbles, cobwebs slowly wave in the corner as you enter the building. Door is locked with a simple lock. Hmm. This is probably just some place I can rest. Looks like everybody left in a hurry. This meat. I mean, it's probably people meat, but meat nonetheless. It's just. Oh, fuck! What the hell is that? Caleb, please tear down this door. Damn it. A crazed old hag slowly rises from the rags. Um, you only have one leg. Maybe I can stumble you. Oh, thanks. God, that scared the fuck out of me. You find nothing. Okay. Oh. Stairs have been cut. Looks like someone did this intentionally. Okay. Oh. Like, the body is in there. Well, it is filthy and disgusting, but you suspect it as much even before checking it out. The sink has mysterious stains in it. Okay. These are the mailboxes for the building residents. Same thing. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but... The door is too strong for you. Sounds about right. Okay, after getting the hell scared out of me. Anything else around here? Hopefully not enemies. Oh, what the fuck is that? What the? Who the fuck is that? This game. What? Oh, fuck. That's a really weird looking dog. That is really weird. That's a big ass blood emblem symbol thing. I don't know. God. Everything is terrible in this place. Everything. Okay, I can go further this way, so maybe I can find that guy. Oh, I got some files. Good God. Maybe I used that book up in the a little too early. Uh, I'm gonna give Black Caleb the light blue vial. Okay. Yeah, he's completely healed now. I kinda wanna go ahead and use the other one, but I think I'll be okay. Famous last words. 
blue herb. Okay, I can use that. Um, and actually, now that I have the blue herb, I'm going to go ahead and mix that with the red herb. Okay. That gives me the more potent one. This is actually turning out okay right now. Blue vial. Getting all the health now. That's exactly what I needed to. Where does this go? Oh, the pipe. What does it say? Um, shopping district is to the north. The Church of All Myrrh is to the east. The business district is to the left over here and to the west, I mean. And St. Demox Orphanage is to the northwest. Okay. I'm going to go down these steps just so I can check those trash cans, but mushrooms do white blue vial. Why are I just throwing away some good shit? Okay. The poignant rooftops of Prey will rise before you. Is that a beheaded person right there? Two beheaded people. Well, three people that have been tied to the post. Who's that? He is long gone. There are multiple pecking wounds across his body. Yep. They've been out here for a second. But who put him out there? Shotgun shell. Nice. Paprika. Just be a little mindful. Vegetable pie. I don't want to get caught out in the open. Be careful. Okay. Nothing really back here. Can't check that. What is this place? Door is stuck. What was this? An interesting looking statue. It reads for for fertility and prosperity. Is that um for I think it's Sylvania? This, I don't like this. This is narrow. Narrow usually means an attack. Chantrell. Lavender. God, this place is huge. Red herb. Nice. Trash container. It reeks horrible. Shotgun shell. Okay. Got meat. Okay, somebody is. Uh, how do I do it? Uh, 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 nope. There we go. Last vial. Not really useful. Okay. Chalk. And beer. What is this? There's a person tightly wrapped in barbed wire. The barbed wire seems to be coated in some kind of murky liquid. Take some of the wire. You find a thorn ring. Okay. Door is stuck. There's nothing over here. Okay, so this seems like it's been a waste of time going all the way over here. What about this? Nope, can't go there. What the fuck is that? You know what? Yep, not worried about it. I'm gonna go. Mind my own business. Just gonna go back from whence I came. Okay. Um, what did it say? Is it this way? Oh, it doesn't say, but I'm assuming that takes me back around, and I don't know if I really want to go that way, so... Let's continue onward. Now, if I could find some place to save, that would be even better, but. 
Oh my God. I don't know what that, oh my God. What the fuck is going on now? Oh, it is fast. Whatever that is, it is fast. I want no parts of that. That was huge. I don't know what the fuck that was, but it was huge. Ah, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh no. No, no, no. Bookstore. Okay. The air stands still. Everything feels eerily peaceful. Okay. All right. A Bobby. Um, I just want to check the bookshelf real quick. Oh, something there. Okay. God. Is there really nothing here? Is there really not one singular book? Yeah. Oh, I, I guess I could be kind of stuck here. Ah, uh, damn it. Oh, wait. Uh, sure. Let's draw that. Damn it. Doesn't do anything. Oh, man. Now I'm just, I'm kind of stuck once again. Fuck. Mm, I'm just going to start. Packing limbs, I don't know. I like how as soon as I start getting some help and stuff, then that's when I kind of get in these screwy situations where I can't really do anything. Great, wonderful. Thank you. Rev up, can I hit your head? Thank you. Good lord. So that actually wasn't too bad. Beat him so he doesn't get back up. Okay. Nobody bread. That wasn't useful at all, but whatever. Okay, now we can probably check the library in peace. Oh, wait, I didn't read any of that. A random suspense novel has been set here. The tale tells about stormy waters northwest from the shores of Rondon. Two brothers who established a fishing route on a particular dangerous on a particularly dangerous waters finally pushed their luck too far and were caught in a massive whirlwind. Even if the subject doesn't especially interest you, the tale does get your heart racing and you can vividly imagine the monstrous whirlwind swallowing the brothers down to its bottomless depths. But is there a book of enlightenment here? Last Frontier, Chapter One. Alchemilia, Volume Three. The Tale of Pocket Cat, Chapter Two. I don't care about any of those. I don't care about any of that. I needed a damn book of enlightenment. My luck with the Book of Enlightenment has just been so shit. Erotica. Erotica. Yep, a lot of nothing here. Lot of nothing. Hmm. Sure, I guess. Nothing interesting here anymore. Romance. Fuck. Yep, it's nothing here. Um, well, shit. Is there anything around the corner? Well, there was two entrances here, so it's that one. Hey, officer. 
No, 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 no. Don't you do that. Don't you do that. Yeah, you go back and fuck off. Please don't shoot me. Ow. Oh. I mean, the absolute literal hell that this place is. Oh. The Kaiser. Okay. Oh. I remember. You get too close, he'll shoot your ass. Oh! Oh, fuck! And I said that and got too close. I don't like that bait and switch, you asshole. Jesus. Can I go up there now? Thank you, you jerk. Tails. Wonderful. Mm. I can't. Nope. <laughs> I was about to say, I kind of want to go down there, but I saw that. Blue vial, nice, okay. And now we have to deal with Osa again, great. I strongly advise keeping your distance. You notice the yellow mage ahead. What do you mean? People approach the festival different ways. I don't know you well enough to tell what your true intentions are. So as a precaution, just keep your distance and perhaps you will see tomorrow. I don't intend to take any, take unnecessary risk. It's nothing personal. You'll attack me if I come closer. I gave you a warning. If you come closer, I consider that hostile behavior and act accordingly. Oh my God, dude, but I need to get by. If I go back to the other screen, will he turn around and leave? Cause I don't want to have to attack him, but I need to get by. Oh, maybe I can go down here. Let's talk about that. Hey, officer. No, no, I got damn it, I got stuck. Uh Please don't kill Black Caleb. Thank you for missing. What? He grew all of it back. Jesus. Um. Let me go ahead and give him a light blue. I only got one. Okay, I'm going to hit one of those arms. Hopefully, Black Caleb will hit the other one. Oh, fuck. Come on. 16. Damn. And now he stops shaking his head, you bastard. Wonderful. Fucking wonderful. Sorry, Black Caleb. Well, you got me here. So I guess there's that. What's over here? Goat hoof. The irony. I don't think you could go this way in the demo. A 
tranquil lake view opens in front of you. You hear a gunshot. Okay. What does that mean, though? I didn't mean to keep going. Oh, I'm going to mind my own business. Or, oh, damn. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> my day just keeps getting better and better. Uh, let's. Um, sir, can you leave me alone? Like, I just, I was minding my own business, and I feel like we got off on the wrong foot. Ow. Oh. Hey. I'm going to run. And I can't run. Ow. Oh, shit. Come on, man. Let, let, let me run. Just... Why won't you let me run? Oh, God. Tails, thank you. Let me go. Jesus. Thank you. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, well, that doesn't do anything for me. Hey, I know we just saw each other, but let's think of this in different terms. Um, again, just let me run. Okay. Uh, oh God. Oh God. Oh, he's so fucking fast too. And I can't escape this time. I'm probably gonna die. I just lost a leg. Good for you. You're all defensed up. That's great. That's wonderful. Oh god. Oh god. Uh... Oh no. And it's so many steps to get up. I. I crawled away. Great. I can't leave this room now. I just, I can't leave this room. There's a portrait of a young man on top of the drawer. The person has his face scratched over. Take the portrait. Portrait of a young man. Okay. I mean, that doesn't do anything for me because as soon as I leave this area, I'm gonna die. I feel the rope tightening around my neck with each passing day. The city has always been a narrow-minded, has always been narrow-minded and bigoted. If you didn't follow the doctrine to a T, you'd be persecuted to no end. The priests don't encourage this be here <laughs> behavior with words, but they don't have to. The centuries of inbreeding and inward looking has created an atmosphere where there is no room for deviation, let alone criticism. The mob mentality takes over the town at regular intervals and the gallows become familiar to every nonconformist. I've seen this happen time and time again, yet for some reason, I never imagined becoming can becoming the next in line to go so here we are now i saw the signs i'll prepare my leave in the meantime i take temporary shelter at these outskirts the moon is awfully high tonight i hear noises echo from the heart of the city the mob gathered around that that hollow tower the high priest will have his speech there i fear that i lingered for too long i should have left the city years ago already hmm Take the film reel. You find a lucky coin underneath. There's someone's diary on the floor. Oh, okay, that's what I was reading. I read that. I was trying to check the luggage. There's nothing useful in the drawer. Like someone gathered all their possessions here. You find nothing useful. Well. I'm finna die. 
So there's that. I have a light blue valve. Go ahead and, well, this is 100, right? Well, no, it's 75. Light blue valve is 80. And I'm bleeding. So there's that. Yeah, cloth. Use that. Uh, hmm. I'm in a clinky dink. Because, I mean, there's not really anything I can do once I get outside this door. I can fight, but... That guy is really strong. Let's see the name of this film reel. A regular 8mm film reel. The label has writing, Slow Exposure, Subject 17. Someone has written the following on top of the label. What does fast exposure look like? Okay. Portrait of a young man. An old portrait photo photograph of a young man. It looks like the photo was taken in the late 1800s. The person's face has been scratched over and it's beyond recognition. Okay. Well then, um, hmm. Yep, really don't know what to do here. I mean, I guess if I'm very, very, very quick, I could turn around and um, use a... Uh, one of those bombs, but let me just try and use a pet pill. Okay. Let's proceed. Oh, whoa, oh, oh shit. Ha! 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 Oh no. Oh no. No! No! Leave me alone! Oh god. I just want to go home. Just let me live. Ah, I'm literally crawling on the ground, sir. I have no threat to you. Ow. Ugh. Oh, God. No. <laughs> God damn it. Come on. Come on. I'm so close. Thank you. Now while you do that, let me run. Damn it. Ow. Come on. It's a little bit more. Ah, fuck. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> this city. This fucking city. God. Okay. Healing. I don't have any more. Uh... Oh, but I can tear up my sweater. So let me do that. Craft item. Uh, where are you at? No, don't you lie to me. I, what? That was a thing. I know that was a thing. Come on. I know that was a thing. Because I remember seeing it. Like. Because I even remember seeing it and it was just like, why the hell with the sweater thing be right there? Ah, oh, son of a. Oh, ha, ha. Well, is there anything I can do then? I mean, I'm just gonna keep bleeding. I don't have... Well, let me see if I can read through these books and maybe find something. But then again, I don't think you actually need to read the books because 
you usually get the skills as soon as they're you um you acquire the book uh, it shouldn't be anything important yep i don't know Was it just because I had Black Caleb in the party? Like maybe it was an ability he had or something? Ah, oh, great. Story of my life. Let me just hurry up and get in the damn church, cause Hey, okay, all right. White Val. I don't think the White Val actually helps with uh, blood loss, right? Yeah, it just helps with poison and stuff. Uh, fuck. Is there any food I can eat that helps with poison? Nope. Uh, I don't know how much damage that actually does. Fears. Yeah, that just I already read that earlier. Yep, that's all I got for crafted items. Good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, I guess I can only do it when I had Black Caleb in the party or something. I don't know. But I do remember seeing the option once. Oh, thank you. Claw fragment. Okay. Use that immediately. Okay. Um, I have a light blue vowel and a blue vowel. Uh, should I? Well, I'll go ahead and use the blue vowel. So this isn't the worst situation. It's not the greatest situation. I would have preferred to have Black Caleb with me, but alas, here I am. So I need to get the bolt cutters, but then, yeah, this should be over here, right? Yep. All right, so I got the bolt cutters. And I need to knock that thing down. I think this was the best way to do it. Shillings. Ah, oh, goddamn it. Okay. I also have to be really careful when I do this because I don't want to end up in combat. Please don't notice me. Please don't notice me. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Yep, I'm gone. Okay, did that. I don't even need whatever the other stuff was that I had. Just need to go down here. I 
I don't think there was anybody that I actually needed to fight. It's locked from the other side. Is there anybody in there? Oh, so tell me, what are the most vile and despicable acts you have performed? So that all myrrh may absolve your sins, of course. Um, I have killed. Hmm, I see. Killing is never a light matter. Tell me, was it a murder or a killing? Did you plan the act? Uh, it was... Okay, I didn't plan on doing it. I I was just upset and I was like, I can murder these people. So it wasn't like I planned to do it. It was just it happened. Um it was self-defense. Is that so? Given the circumstances, it is not outside the boundaries of what is possible. Dots. Did you know the person you killed? Uh yes. Oh, so it was a personal affair. Hmm, that just makes the impact that much bigger, am I right? Well then, do you feel this killing was justified? It was self-defense. Self-defense or not, you are in a confessional telling me about this event. So surely you don't feel it being a justified slaughter. Dots. How did you feel afterwards, after the slaughter? Um. Uh, Honestly, I didn't feel anything. It can be worrying to realize just how quickly we get used to killing. But then again, the city is is as it is, so I cannot blame you. It's not like my hands are entirely clean of blood either. Dots. Well, let's move on. Did your actions have consequences? Everything has consequences in life. Very true. It is not always you who has to live with the consequences, though. Now, the important question is, are you going to continue on this path of massacre? Or was it just or was this just a single occurrence? Um, I will kill again if I have to. Dots. Yes, it is good not to make empty promises. Sounds like you've resolved your inner conflict by yourself. To absolve your sins, do a ritual sacrifice or two, and you should be good. <laughs> and try to go get some and try to get good sleep. Eat your vitamins and love your neighbor. That is all. What? You feel as though a weight has been lifted from your shoulders, as if your sins have been been absolved. With your confessions, your affinity with the Almer is growing. Oh. <laughs> it was a joke. I made a joke. <laughs> My apologies. I'm not a priest of Almer in reality. This was just too good of an opportunity to pass. I can get to know the true you. I confided to you. I feel exploited. <laughs> oh, very funny. Ha ha ha. Well then, I got the information I needed. I think I must continue my journey for now. Time is not exactly a resource we have in excess. Um, Where are you going? This land holds many secrets. What you see and hear on the surface is not the whole truth. Again, I apologize if my trick was too rude. Goodbye for now. No, no, god damn it! <laughs> Oh, God. Everybody just comes and goes. Nobody wants to stay around and be like, you know what? Strength in numbers. Fuck you too, then. Jesus. I mean, what an absolute ass. Yeah, yeah, you're stuck in there, I know. Now, I don't actually have to fight anybody so let's try to avoid that if we can arrow passageways arrow passageways ok 
Okay. I have the martyr effigy. That's what I needed. Then I just have to get the hell out of here. All right, got the church key and the sewer key. Yellow vial. I don't remember what the yellow vial is for. Here. It's so one good thing about the wheelchair. It makes you very fast. Hey, buddy. I'm going to go through here. You just keep doing you. Okay, not going there. What the fuck? Oh shit. Uh... Damn it. Uh... <clears throat> it's two of these guys, too. Um, If I can run, I will do that. Yep. Right. Uh, nope, that was a trap. That was a trap. That was a trap. What the fuck? Uh. Wait, I feel like this is all one big trap. That is a trap. Okay. Where is this? Oh, okay, this is the other side. Cool. Um, this goes back up, correct? Oh, God damn it. Wait, can I get around this? Okay, yeah, I can. Okay, all right. Now I can get out of this damn city. Um, or at least, oh, wait. What does this do now that I think about it? Okay. It seems to be a place for something here. There are carvings of an old time language, the martyr that tries to overcome its idols. Place the martyr effigy on the pedestal? Yes. That That's it. The martyr effigy is set on the pedestal. There are carvings of... Okay. Oh, wait. Is it three you have to get? There seems to be a place for something here. The carvings of an old time language. The hunger and vengeance. Seems to be a place for something here. The fellatio of mankind. Actually, I think that is supposed to be over there. Or maybe that was right. I'm not sure. Because I thought Almera was the one where if you use magic on him or something like that in the first game, just he would, yeah, be excited. Um, I can hold off on food for a little bit. Hmm. I mean, I don't think there's really anything else I have to do here. Um. So actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and head back. Yeah, I think I'm going to head back to the train. Ah, oh, fuck. I went through so much trying to get here too. I don't want to die. Oh, wait, 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 whoa, whoa. What? I did not know he was still going to be there. He was in the confessional. Oh, you got to be fucking kidding me. You have got to be joking. You 
can fall now. Uh, that doesn't stagger you? Why does that not stagger you? Oh, come on. This kills me. Okay. Great. This was this has been wonderful. And I ended up having to kill you anyway. I lost a leg and an arm behind this. You got to be fucking kidding me. <sighs> Well, I got mixed herbs, so let's use that. Um, I don't have a cloth frag. Okay, I do have a cloth fragment. So yeah, there you go. I had to kill him anyway. Also, why am I moving slow? You mean to tell me that I lost a leg and now I'm moving slower? Oh, it's because I lost an arm, son of a bitch. I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. Look at this. Look at this. Hell, I think I'm actually faster crawling. No, it's actually the same. Oh my god. I didn't even know he was going to be over here. Like, what? <laughs> Great. Great. It's wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. And I'm going to get shot. I might as well just fight the guy. And I'm probably gonna get shot at least two or three times before I get to him. Even better. Oh, Bobby. Ah. Well, let me just hit him in the chest. That's all I can really do. And just kind of hope he misses. Ow. 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 Shaking his head. Rev up. Rev up. Good. Okay. Nope. I don't care about that. Okay. Look at this. Look at this. Right, another Bobby. I probably have one. <laughs> I have four health. <laughs> My God, I'm not gonna hit his head, but whatever. Ah, uh, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, I'm gonna call it quits right there. Um. I mean, I did save with Black Caliph, so I just need to get around um, the Bobby and hopefully not get killed. And then I can go into um, the church and I'll just have to remember to avoid that the next time around. But in the next video, I'll just go ahead and I won't include all that 
in the next video, I'll start the video with me having defeated everything in the basement and done everything that needed to be done. I'll just go ahead and skip past all of that. And I'll start with hopefully me at the sewer entrance and then we can head into the sewer. So if you like the video, like the video, if you want to see more content like this, subscribe. I have a lot of things on the channel. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to leave them in the comment section and I will get to them as soon as I possibly can. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. See ya.